Hello, my lovely Pisces. How are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing a, read, a love reading for the next 10 days in love. So we're going to see what the next 10 days look like for you guys. Personal readings are open and on sale. You can receive a recorded video reading, three questions for $20, or an hour-long Zoom reading for $50. And everything that you'll need to know about scheduling is in the description box below for you. We are inviting your angels, spirit guides, and ancestors to come in and assist us with this reading today. All right, Pisces, let's take a look and see what's going on for you guys. The overall energy is the Three of Wands. I feel like you're very skeptical about something here, Pisces. This is your energy showing up here with this page of swords in the reverse. To me, that feels like very skeptical. This page of cups being the situation. So somebody could be reaching out to you here, Pisces. Somebody could be expressing some emotions to you, an apology even. And I and I feel like you're very skeptical. You're, you're not really sure... You're not really sure if it's genuine. You're not really sure if you can believe it or not. You got the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse for their energy. You know, I'm going to clarify that one, but to me, it does feel like somebody could have realized what they've lost. Uh, to me, this is like see, feeling like they've really lost something that was very valuable to them, and maybe it took them a while to figure that out. We got the Page of Wands here, so. That's what's causing them to take a step towards you here, Pisces, is I do feel like this person has realized something here about what they had with you. That being said, because this person could have even, they could have rejected you in the past with this Four of Cups being the challenge, and maybe that's why you're so skeptical about it. Um, for others of you, you know, they could have just treated you in a way that caused you to have to walk away from them. And either way, the Four of Cups can either represent them rejecting you or this could be you doing that to them now. You know, you being closed off, you being unsure. You're not fully open to this, okay? And that is because you're so skeptical. There's something about it where you're just not sure if this person is genuine or not. Now, something that you're not aware of, you do have the Six of Wands. So somebody really does want this to work and be successful. They're hoping for a very positive outcome here. They could be coming in and giving you a lot of attention. Page of Swords. They could be seeing you get a lot of attention and that could have really triggered them. Yeah, we get this Nine of Wands. It came out in the reverse though. They don't want to see you let them go. So for, for some of you guys, this person could have gotten triggered by seeing you get a lot of attention or seeing you get some attention or recognition for something here. For others of you, don't take that on if it's not for you. I just feel like this person really is coming in not wanting to see you let them go. They're wanting a very successful, positive outcome here. The outcome in this situation, we have the judgment card in the reverse with the seven of wands in the reverse. I feel like you're very hesitant. You're not sure if this is somebody that you can afford to let your guard down with again. I feel like you've opened up to them in the past and they could have really hurt you. And I feel like because you're so skeptical, you're like, I'm just really not sure here. Is this somebody that I can let my guard down with? Is this somebody I should allow back into my life or not? So I feel like that's the place that you're going to be in the next 10 days. This person's coming in Pisces and they're expressing how they feel to you. They're apologizing and you're not sure if you can believe it here. Tell me more about this four of cups. Yeah, we got the five of swords. Yeah, very, very conflicted. So I feel like emotionally you're guarded when it comes to this person. You're not sure if you can, you know, let them in again. What advice do we have for Pisces in this situation? We got the Hermit in the reverse, making sure that you're really taking your time to reflect. I do feel like there's a new opportunity here, but, you know, Spirit says make sure that you're really taking your time to look within and be very honest with yourself, okay, about what it is that's best for you here. We're going to pull another advice card for you. Now, this can be something that Spirit wants you to be aware of, work on, or reflect on, Pisces. Try to learn something new. Challenge yourself. Do not limit your challenge, but challenge your limits. Self-exploration and getting to know yourself. 
So these are things that spirit wants you to focus on at this time. And I find that to be very interesting that that comes out with this hermit type energy of really wanting you to look within and be honest with yourself. Is this aligned with who I'm trying to be and where I'm trying to go? So just something spirit wants you to reflect on. But that is what I have for you, Pisces. If it resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, then check out your other placements. Everything that you need to know, whether it's about this reading, scheduling your personals, Patreon, the tarot course, all of that is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, you can just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, guys, thank you for being here and supporting me and I will see you soon.